This video is created for version 3.0 install smart POS. And in this video, I'll be showing you the Boost Mobile Activation Integration process. The Boost Mobile Activation Integration feature in Salesmart POS helps you save time by not having you to enter the required information in the Boost Portal website once you have entered in the software. So let's go ahead and perform a new activation to see how this feature works by clicking on the inventory, serialize inventory, and selecting a phone. So we click on Boost Mobile. And let's say we're selling an iPhone 6 and we select any phone from here and we click on this sale button and we'll be presented with the activation type window here we select what kind of activation we're doing so we want to do a new activation so we select new activation and in the activation details tab we have to enter the customers information so let's enter the customers name let's say we enter James address enter the email address as well and if you already have a pin you can enter that as well in the pin field we can also select our plan within this activation type window by selecting on the by clicking on the plan selection tab. So let's say this customer wants Boost Mobile and a $40 unlimited plan. And let's go ahead and click save. And now that we have added the plan and the phone within one invoice, we can check out this customer by clicking the checkout button. And let's say the customer is paying us cash, so we click save. And once we have completed this transaction, we will be given a notification on the bottom left corner of the software stating our pending activations, which means that we are still not done with these activations and we have to enter additional information to mark them complete. And as you can see here, we have three pending activations and the one we just performed is this one with the $40 unlimited plan. And in order to perform a Boost Mobile activation integration, you may click on the activation button and then click on start activation. For this, you are required to set up your account through CellSmart, which you can learn how to do by clicking on the link above. And you'll be presented with the Boost Mobile Activation window. And as you can see on the left-hand side, the information we entered in the software is already listed. So we are not required to enter the same information all over again. And the device's serial number is visible as well. So let's do a standard activation and click check. Next. And since we already entered the zip code, it's already visible. So let's continue. And this is giving us the new phone number information. So let's click next. And as you can see, the information we entered in the software is already entered in the Boost Portal website. Let's enter a last name as well, which is required. Confirm our email address. Select our preferred language and create a pin and click next if you have a promo code available you can enter that here and select the price plan since the list does not contain the $40 plan we can just select the 35 unlimited talk and text plan and add it to our cart and once this is added we may click next and this is the price plan review section to see your price plan details. And once you have received the money from the customer for the activation, you can go ahead and click on the activate button. And this process will take a few minutes. And as you can see on the left hand side, the customer's information and the phone information is visible in addition to the plan information and the phone number and the activation type. So let's go ahead and proceed with this activation by clicking on the proceed button. And as you can see, the number that was provided through the activation is already entered into software. And now we can mark this activation as complete by clicking on the save button. And once we click on the save button, the activation will disappear from the pending activations, which tells us that it is completed. And that's how you do a Boost Mobile activation integration in CellSmart POS.